is a quick trip I took on 912. I had a couple hours that I uh, could get out there. So I snuck out for about two hours. It's real nice when you got a boat in the water. It just makes it easier to just grab and go to do it. So what I decided to do was just go check on some of the local pots that are close to the inlet and just see what fish are there because I heard reports that there were some mahi mahi being caught so I never went further than about two miles offshore and I just checked some of the local pots and here you're going to see some of the action that we have hope you enjoy the video, thank you Sorry about the radio being loud, it really wasn't that loud in the boat, I don't know why it's coming through so loud in the video. And the first fish is a little bonito. Little bonito. Thanks to a viewer on a previous video, I now know that this next fish that gets caught is a blue runner. Thank you again, Eric. As I was drifting close to the pots, I saw that there were fish from top to bottom on some of them, so I decided to try to jig from the bottom up to try to get some of the bigger marks that I saw down there and I ended up getting another blue runner. Got another one of those little blue runners, I think. I'm on something. That's not what you want. That is what I want, sort of. That's a Benito, but it's kind of small. Pay attention to the left hand side of the screen, and you're going to see a fish swim through here that's long and lean, and it was about uh, 18 inches to 20 inches long. I'll zoom in on it just to get a better Oh, that's idea a mahi. Oh, that's a mahi. Hopefully that showed up, but with the polarized glasses on, it looked like it was probably about an 18 this inch is. to 20 inch chicken mahi. Uh, not in the motor. I think it's a false albacore. Nope, that is a good size little bonita. So this little bonito put up the best fight of the day. You heard it was still taking some drag and I had the drag set a little heavier because I was trying to get the mahi. So right after this, we decided to troll around for a little while, trolling around the pots with a Clark spoon, trying to get the, uh, see if we could stir up any mahi that were just ambling through the area. So 
that was a nice little two hour trip that we took so it's always nice to get out there any chance you get so i hope that you enjoyed the video and remember to like subscribe and come back for more action thank you very much